All right, here's the second video talking about uh, the formation of sedimentary rock. In the previous video, um, I talked about the formation of sediments and how the sediments will be created and um, will erode and finally be deposited into a body of water in, in many cases. And so we have the sediments forming. It erodes down and it is deposited and settles at the bottom of a body of water. And then over time we may get another layer of sediments that will look a little bit different. And then yet a third layer of sediments on top of that. And the pile gets thicker and thicker and thicker. And as you can imagine, um, the weight of it will be felt by the rocks at the very bottom. So the rocks here, the sediments at the bottom here, will feel kind of uh, the brunt of all the pressure. And so we have this pressure and this weight pushing down and it's squeezing it. And that term for that is compaction. So it compacts down and it squeezes down onto the rocks. So um, that's the first term in the formation of, of uh, our sedimentary rock. So looking down at the bottom part of the screen, let's uh, recreate what will happen here. So we have these layers. bottom layer was white. And the next layer was uh, kind of this aqua. So if we take a close-up view of all these sediments piled up on one another, getting squeezed together, there's still going to be um, some gaps in, in its formation here. All right, it's compacted, it's squeezed, um, but uh, there's still going to be these gaps. And what happens is, again, we're underwater, so we have the water seeping through and the minerals inside the water kind of squeezing through, making its way in between all these sediments that are squeezed, in, squeezed together through compaction. All right. And what happens is the minerals in the water kind of form, uh, act like a glue, and it cements everything together. And so that's our second term, cementation. cementation. And we end up having the sediment squeezed together and then the minerals kind of gluing the sediments together and forming a sedimentary rock. And oftentimes when you have a sedimentary rock you're going to find that you can kind of look at it and see the, uh, the striations. You can see the layers of what created that rock. Um, I think blue is next. So if you look carefully sometimes, you can see that um, the different layers of sediment that created the sedimentary rock in the first place. And our last one. And you would see something like that. So then we get our sedimentary rock. Okay, so we started with weathering, uh, creating our sediments, and then we had erosion, uh, pushing the sediments uh, down and depositing them, deposition, depositing them at the bottom of, of a body of water, and then the weight of all the sediments, compacting them, squeezing them together, and then the minerals inside of the water getting in between uh, the different spaces of these little tiny rocks and kind of gluing it together and so finally we end up with our sedimentary rock. So I hope that um, is clear to you. Um, if not, go back, take a look at the first video again and watch this one. Alright, thanks for watching.